With the aim of supporting farmers, the government has put forward 50 million kina into the Agriculture Department to roll out the price support program. The money is shared to all commodity boards to subsidize the prices of commodities so farmers continue to sell their cocoa or coffee at the same rate. From the 50 million kina, coffee and cocoa got 10 million kina, copra got 4 million and rubber got 2 million kina. Titled as Effective Intervention Programs, Palm Oil got 2 million kina, Spice Board got 1 million kina, Livestock Development got 6 million kina, Fresh Produce 3 million kina, and the rice sector got 5 million kina. But the 50 million kina is not sufficient if the government wants to really assist the farmers. This concern was raised by many commodity boards with Agriculture Minister John Simon bringing it up to the Prime Minister during the PM's visit to Maprik. According to John Simon, who has always been passionate about the industry, the sector will need 50 million kina per month and not per year. Prime Minister Miller asking you, we need to at least put... 10 to 15 million kina every month to continue to support this program. No God, but it's the program but you don't have to continue. And we even put the money directly, we're going to support the one very low place. And we need close to 200 million kina to see this happen. The Prime Minister wasted no time to respond, assuring farmers to farm the land as his government will continue to put money into this program. We like you, man, and Mary, throw my hand to the garden. Instead of you wasting time, stop will say nothing, nothing, no town. Go back to work, look at it, and hopefully partnership with districts, partnership with provinces, starting with Maprik and Isipik, and same partnership will grow right across our country. And we look forward to people earning more money from money that is coming out in your own land as you work. There are currently a lot of respective commodity buyers and exporters. Therefore, respective commodity boards have identified selected buyers to buy from the farmers to be given the price support rate. In Maprik District, following the launch of the price support program for cocoa, the business arm of the District Development Authority is given this support to purchase from farmers, promising them more for their hard work. The price support program is also aimed at encouraging more villages to get into commodity farming and increase their yield.